Hello, I'm Jeannie Mellish. Today I'm going to talk to you about drawing Michael life drawings of action, po action poses. I like to, uh, it's nice to draw Michael. We discuss the action poses before we begin and we draw it out of doors and it's nice to be out of doors so long as the weather's permitting. Um, action poses are interesting because they show the muscles where there's tension and where the body weight is. And, and as the body weight swings, there's a tense side and a relaxed side of the body. This is the tense side where the body is way swinging to that side, the legs wide apart, but this, uh, this leg is holding the weight. That leg is relaxed very relaxed and this one is tense the weight is here and swinging more and this arm is stand is up but not for tense it's balancing the body that's why it's out and this is the the tennis racket is behind his head and the muscles are that side and the relaxed side is that side No. Um, this is Michael holding the, the weights. He's, he's using weights. He's holding them behind his head and the, the shoulders are taking the weight. The arms and the shoulders and the neck are, are, are holding tremendous weight. And, and he's, he's standing upright. Um, you can't see the far hand but they're big, heavy metal discs. And, um, and the, the drawing is done with the yellow and, and the brown Conte quail for no reason other than the, the, the ones which were at hand. And there's, it's, there's not much strong shadows, just the strength of the hand holding the weights. pose Michael has, is holding the, the weights in front of his head and you can see the, the muscles in his arm are really taking a strain and his, the back is taking a strain and I wanted to show the back more importantly so I, I put this dark behind the back so that the, the back would come forward in as you look at the picture. You see the strength in the back and the hips moving forward and, and he's tilted so that so that the back is taking the weight. And it's charcoal on white paper. This is a picture of um, Michael with taking, uh, it's, it's in um, using water-based, it's they're called aqua bricks. Um, they're like little blocks of colour and I dilute them and, and so that I can paint with them as well as draw with them. And um, I, I I wet a lot of the paper and just put the paint in so, so the paint flows and the blue and the red together mel um, mix in on the wet paper and you can see that it goes almost black when the two colours mix and so this these two colours for no reason just I'm using them to portray the, the angle of, of the flesh, or the angle of, of the body swinging to the left and the, that takes the weight 
the weight is and and the, the rhythm is that way so this will be the relaxed side and that will be the strong side and this arm is up balancing and the whole thing is the whole body is weight on that side um, and with the two colors they, they they make really an important dark which which is a very very quick way of of painting and I put green behind and um, remember the paint goes on to wet pa paper in this in this case not always but in this case you can see how it is going on to wet paper and it just immediately flows and runs and it has its own um, volition. Is um, the pose is 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 archery. The, the subject is archery, and there is a scabbard hanging off his neck over, across his back, and his hand is going up, and he's choosing um, an arrow coming out of the scabbard and he's got his bow in his hand and he's going to be using a bow and an arrow. Can I go for Yes. Go. With the subject of the bow and arrow, the archery, um, the model, Michael, is holding the interesting bow. It's um, I think it's sort of a, it's a historic ancient Turkish bow, I think it is. And he's just twanging the string. Um, he's got the arrow in his hand that he's just put up off the scabbard, which is around his neck. Um, the muscles in his arm tense, and this muscle's holding it. It's not a very heavy bow and neither was the arrow heavy but there's going to be a lot of tension there. Um, his, his main weight is on that but he's also on that as well and um, he's, going, he's, he's swinging towards this side because he's going to lean forwards and it is charcoal on white paper. on again. Uh, this is light grey paper, it's light grey pastel paper and I'm using pastels with pastel colours for the flesh and it's got the green background and the, this, the, um, the quills are on the arrows, feathers, black and white feathers and that's the scabbard going down his, his, and, and the strap goes round there and it's ready for him. He's positioning, he's looking at his target and positioning his hand ready on the on the bow and his 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 weight is forward on his left leg. This is still strong, but there's going to be a lot of tension with the hands. And he's going to move the arrow right up to his eye in one moment, but he's not ready for it quite yet. You're on. A Conte drawing with black Conte crayon uh, used on its side to make yep. these effects here and uh, used on the point make the, the drawing. Um, he's got his the, the strength in the in there and and that arm is holding the bow which you can't see but you can see the arrow and he's eye he's eyeing it up 
and he's aiming, aiming with his arrows, ready to aim, he's just positioning himself. Conte on white paper. Charcoal on white paper. The charcoal is very easy to do a quick drawing and if you make a mistake you can wipe it off just with the side of your hand. Um, and it's, um, it's very versatile. You can get a really strong black if you want to but I didn't use, I just wanted it to, to show where the shadows were on the side of the face, in the, on that, that arm, and the shadow on the rock, as the rock her, he's, he's choosing his handhold and he's working his way up the rocks with the rope to help him. And it's um, charcoal on white paper. Okay. Once again, charcoal on white paper. He's got his rope. He's using the rope to haul himself up. Um, that's not really the right position for the foot, but I did it very quickly. And his, he's just about to swing his body upwards onto this arm, onto this leg. Um, muscles using the muscles to pull himself up and um, and he'll go up the cliff and this is charcoal on white paper and that is all thank you very much well thank you for watching thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it and maybe you may have learned something about life drawing um, about drawing the human figure and if you would like to subscribe to my channel the colorful world of genie colorful spelt with a u as in the english way and genie is j-e-a-n-i-e -E, one n well thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it thank you and goodbye